Hi, my name's Robert. I live in Johannesburg. I was born in Johannesburg and I have no immediate intention of leaving Johannesburg. It's a great place to live. South Africa is a fantastic place to live um, for a whole lot of reasons. Uh, I guess at the moment we're sitting up in Mahalisburg, a mere hour and a half away. It's, uh, it's been a place that I've been coming to since I was a small baby and uh, have the privilege of coming out here on a frequent basis and to be able to come to a place where it's wild, there's bushveld, there's virtually nobody else here and it's so close to a big city and one can forget about the crime and the grime and everything that people complain about because it really is such a spectacular country that uh, one really doesn't want to leave it. It's not only the wild places that we can go to and the huge variety of things that we can see, but it's got uh, wonderful people, um, a whole range of ethnic groups and all of them have exciting uh, components and they're wonderful to be with. And my kids fortunately go to a school where they are interacting with uh, a, a variety of different groups and uh, I think are enriched as a result of that. And apart from that, there are huge opportunities in this country. There are big challenges, which are exciting as well. Um, there's uh, there are all sorts of other things that will keep one here. Um, this morning, as we're eating our various different types of melons and pawpaws and things, um, thinking how much those would cost in some foreign cold climate. And although today is not the most sunny day of the lot, most of the year round we have spectacular weather most people would never have an opportunity to get to. Uh, we travel a great deal around the country. It's, uh, it's got a remarkable diversity from wild coastlines on the east coast, spectacular mountains which we've hiked extensively uh, in the spine of the country, and the most remarkable uh, semi-deserts and deserts on the west. And if one takes the trouble to explore these places, uh, one soon gets an idea that we have a whole world in one country which is uh, quite remarkable and uh, a diversity of both animal, plant and bird life which uh, is hard to beat anywhere else in the world and having spent pretty much my entire life exploring places and learning the birds and the animals and the trees I'd be very reluctant to go somewhere and become a foreigner in some obscure part of the world which really has very little interest to me.